Alrighty guys, what is going up? I hope you guys are all having a great and an amazing day today. Now in today's episode, we're gonna be talking about the top five stocks to buy this August. This past week has been absolutely crazy in the stock market. So I hope you guys enjoy this video and overall, I hope you guys learned something. And if you have any questions, go ahead and ask them down below. Don't forget that you guys can sign up with Moomoo and literally get a free stock just by signing up. So now, let's jump into it, roll the intro, let's go. Alrighty guys, so the very first stock here I do think has a lot of uh, potential this August here is TD, also known as TD Ameritrade or TD Bank here. Now this stock had some highs that are on $62, and some resistance here at around 60, some support here at really this 200 moving average line. You guys can see that a couple times it did get bought back up on it here, 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 here. You know, so there's definitely some uh, support there. One thing to keep in mind is old support becomes new resistance. So I do think that this stock has some uh, potential for about 44 to about $50. Now, not to mention the long-term potential of this stock is actually pretty good. It does have a beautiful upward trend and not to mention it is, it is paying a fantastic dividend. So I do think that this stock is definitely undervalued by income and dividend investors. And I do think that there is a lot of long-term potential with, the, with this one. And since the stock is undervalued right now this August, I do think that this is a good stock to get into here. Now the next one here is ticker symbol RUN. This is a renewable energy company and this stock really went from around $9 all the way up to almost $50 a share before getting sold off here. So right now, yes, do I think that the stock's overvalued? Just by looking at it, yes, I do think it is. But if I actually got into this stock, I would want it to be around a 30 to about $25. I definitely that think that this stock has a lot of long-term potential. I do think that we are only gonna get more dependent on renewable energies and more clean energy, and this stock and company definitely follows that. And you know, long-term potential, long-term play with this stock is definitely very, very strong. Um, this would definitely go down in a little more risky category, but definitely one to definitely keep an eye on this August. Here's symbol R-U-N, pretty good stock here. Now the next one here is Raytheon Tech. You guys can see that this stock has this beautiful upper trend, really an explosive um, you know, power. Stock went from $22, hit highs at around 100 in you know, a pretty short amount of time, you know, in you know, six, seven years. Now this stock fell off a pretty solid amount. This stock is down right now, a solid 42%, so that's way more than the S&P 500, Dow Jones, um, you know, all of those, NASDAQ, all of those. So right now, this stock is extremely undervalued for the long term. The reason why I think that is because, one, this is actually a pretty solid company. They have a lot of future growth. Number two, I think that this stock is just a great stock to get into, one, for their dividend. Around a 3.3% dividend is absolutely amazing, especially for a stock like this. So definitely one to get into right now, I do think is pretty undervalued. Now the next one here, is ticker symbol NIO, also known as NEO. This is a re renewable, uh, you know, electric car company based out of China and Japan. Uh, right now, this stock did actually find some support here at around eleven dollars. Right now, it's trading at around eleven, um, you know, twelve bucks here. Definitely some room room from twelve to about sixteen. And if you guys get into it, just set your stops here at around, you know, ten ten ninety. I think that would be a perfect swing trade is on NEO here. Definitely want to keep an eye on, and I do think that this stock does have some long-term potential. So right now, with it being near a support line is actually pretty pretty good and pretty solid. Now, the number one stock to keep an eye on is Apple. Apple just announced that they are doing a four to one split. So really what this means is for every stock that you guys have with them, you're gonna get three more. So if you guys really load up on shares, you guys are gonna make a ton of money not to mention they do pay a fairly good dividend. Also, once this stock falls to that $100 mark, that's gonna get a lot of new investors who couldn't afford that $420 share price. Now they're gonna be able to get into this. So this is a very, very 
bullish move by Apple. Definitely some uh, you know, long-term play, definitely some swing trades and definitely some position trading with this stock here. So that is it though. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode and if you guys did, make sure you guys smash the like button. It's greatly appreciated. So now we'll see you guys tomorrow. Remember to stay happy, stay positive and overall stay safe out there. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Take care.